The followers of the Black Hand treat the Syracists in a similar manner, not going out of their way to find the servants of the Prince of Lies, but wasting no time slaying them if they are discovered. The Syracists are more active in their pursuit of the Banites, but the feeling is otherwise mutual. Individual members of the Church of Syric tend to have many enemies, particularly within their own organization. Fortunately, these feelings shift quickly at all but the highest levels of power, so someone who is an enemy one day might not be one the next. Because they engage in murder and deceit across the continent, and because their deity is a foe of every other deity, followers of Syric expect to be opposed by just about anyone that discovers their identity. Even followers of other evil deities have been known to interrupt a battle with heroes when a group of violent Syracists arrives. Syracists prefer to travel alone or in small groups, because larger groups are more difficult to manage, with all the internal conflict and backstabbing, and likely to draw attention. A typical encounter with a group of Syracists is a cleric leader, plus a wizard or sorcerer and one or two barbarian, fighter, or ranger bodyguards, all worshippers of Syric. Barbarian bodyguards are common in barbarian lands, fighters in civilized lands and on well-traveled roads, and rangers in forested regions. The wizards who work with Syric rarely specialize in a school of magic since they lack the discipline to focus on a single school. Syracists encountered on the road may be moving to or from a known temple, preparing to establish a cult cell in the middle of a mission of war, or fleeing persecution elsewhere. Those founding a cell or fleeing another place are more likely to be secretive and non-confrontational toward any they meet, not wishing to draw attention to themselves. The others display their allegiance openly and violently challenge any groups they think they can overcome, or whose destruction they think would benefit the church. The forces of Syric are generally too undisciplined to formulate consistent group tactics. Each individual tends to act independently, trying to balance the desire to slaughter many foes in the name of Syric and the fear that one's allies will take advantage of the distractions of combat to eliminate a rival. Only in the presence of a powerful and respected leader are Syracists able to coordinate their attacks. This does not mean they are stupid, they don't interfere with each other's attacks and take advantage of cooperative opportunities when they occur, but they rarely enter combat with these plans in mind. About half of Syric's clerics use their spells to augment their physical prowess and attack their foes in melee, while the rest attack directly with their spells. Both types shout the glories of the Dark Sun while in combat. <laughs>